The Air Force saw a critical milestone this week for its highest priority strategic program, the B-21 Raider Stealth Bomber. On September 11th, the Department of the Air Force announced that the second B-21 test aircraft has arrived at Edwards Air Force Base in California and has officially joined the flight test campaign. The addition of a second aircraft is a massive force multiplier for the program. It allows the Air Force to conduct parallel testing, which dramatically accelerates the path to an initial operation capability. According to the Air Force Chief of Staff, General David Alvin, this will bring this capability to our warfighters faster. This parallel approach is crucial for a complex, software-defined platform like the B-21. While the first jet continues to focus on flight sciences, pushing the envelope on speed, altitude, and maneuverability, the second aircraft can be dedicated to thousands of hours of testing required to validate its advanced mission systems. This includes its sensors, communication suites, electronic warfare systems, and, critically, weapons integration. This congruent activity could shave months or even years off the development timeline. Additionally, having two aircraft allows maintainers to begin developing sustainment procedures, providing invaluable early data for logistics and technical manuals to ensure the support infrastructure is ready when the B-21 arrives at its first main operating base at Ellsworth Air Force Base, South Dakota.